and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a very interesting experiment. We are going to make a floating compass. All you need is a magnet, a pin, and a baking paper, and a pencil, and a scissor, and a compass to make sure it matches. Baking paper carefully and then trace the surrounding. I mean, trace the plate. Now, you need to get a needle. Then on one side of the needle, draw the magnet 20 times. As you can see, it's a pretty magnet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then flip it around. Then rub it. And flip the magnet around too. See? And then rub it again. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Now my needle is magnetized. Then you need to prick the needle inside the baking paper. And then this is the tricky part. You gotta bend it and prick it the other way, see? At the back how nice it came out. Place the needle and the, and that inside here. See how it's slowly spinning? They match! Now my floating canvas compass is even matching my phone compass. like a huge magnet. At the top, there's the magnetic south pole. At the bottom, there's the magnetic north pole. And we all know the opposite poles attract each other. So, the north pole of the needle points to the magnetic south pole of the earth. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button.